James Coburn was an iconic American actor with a career spanning over five decades. He was known for his rugged good looks, deep voice, and ability to portray tough and charismatic characters with ease. Coburn was born in Laurel, Nebraska in 1928, and his family later moved to California. After serving in the Army, he studied acting under Stella Adler in New York. Coburn made his film debut in 1959 in Ride Lonesome, and he gained widespread recognition for his role as the knife-throwing Brit in the 1960 Western classic The Magnificent Seven. This led to many more roles in films, including the World War II epic The Great Escape, the thriller Charade, and the spy spoof our man Flint. In the 1970s, Coburn continued to be a prolific actor, starring in films such as The Last of Sheila, The Internecine Project, and Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid. He was also known for his work in television, appearing in shows like The Rockford Files and The Dane Curse. Coburn's career had a resurgence in the late 1990s with his acclaimed performance in the film Affliction, for which he won the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor in 1999. On November 18, 2002, James Coburn passed away at the age of 74 from a heart attack. Coburn's death was a shock to the entertainment industry, as he had been an active actor until the end of his life. Coburn was laid to rest at Westwood Village Memorial Park Cemetery in Los Angeles, California. This cemetery is the final resting place of many Hollywood legends, including Marilyn Monroe, Dean Martin, and Natalie Wood. Coburn's grave is marked by a simple headstone with his name, birth, and death dates, and the inscription, Beloved Husband and Father. If you liked this video, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.